Thanks for logging on to MyFoxHurricane.com. Well, overall, things are still pretty quiet across the tropics. Looking at one area across the northern Gulf of Mexico, I was talking about some of that convection across the northern Gulf of Mexico is non tropical in nature, just a, a big disorganized area of convection. The thing is, if you get these areas that hang out long enough, eventually something might start to happen with it. It's still just a trough of low pressure, but as this continues over the next few days, it is expected to drift a bit further to the south and southwest. Models ever so slightly hinting we might see a little gradual development with this. You can tell by the percentages, the chance of something happening with this are obviously very low over the next couple of days and really over the next five days. And really, this isn't going to extend out five days. This will continue to drift down towards the south. Maybe a little bit of development, really kind of an iffy thing whether we even get to that stage because it'll start to work its way on shore and that will spread some heavy rains across eastern, southeastern and southern Texas as we go through the week. And that's really what we're talking about with this. You look further out into the Atlantic. Remember that one Invest 97 we were talking about? That just continues uh, to be just a very disorganized, weak tropical wave moving on to the to the west. Dry air, some stronger winds here. That is starting to become more of an issue out into the central and eastern Atlantic. But we're going to keep our eye on these tropical waves that move off the coastline because what that's doing is that's helping them moisten up the atmosphere a little bit more. And as we continue through the month of August, at some point, one of these is going to start to take hold. And that's what you have to watch for. You watch the Saharan air layer. That is that dust. And we just continue to watch these big plumes of dust working their way off the coast of Africa and moving into the Caribbean up into the Gulf of Mexico. We've had a lot of that dust over us for the past several days. That is working its way out. And we're going to actually see our rain chances here in Florida heading back up over the next several days. So watch the Fox model as we go through the weekend. There you see that area really not showing much in the way of any organization or development, just some rain that will work its way over southern Texas as we head through the weekend and into the first part of next week. Other than that, there's really not much more going on in the tropics. And of course, we'll keep you updated right here on myfoxhurricane.com.